big take. We started up there at the road. Yeah, we started <clears throat> We started up there this morning. That's only 50 yards away, I know. people. <laughs> just we like, do. Shelly's like, what do I say? We're just out for a morning Wait, walk. This is on the, the family farm, um, and everybody in the family kept saying, have you walked down the, the draw yet? And so today's the day we're going to walk down the draw. So we thought we'd bring you guys along. Everybody says it's beautiful down here, so... Um, we're gonna check it out, but there's, I can see evidence of it right here. There's a creek. They said that follows it down here. So there's a creek right over here. Um, but yeah. Okay hey guys, we um, reared off the main path that was down below and um, we're going to hike up here. We did just go down in there and there's a little bog and the creek is down there. But we're going to just walk up this a little bit and see where it takes us. But oh, I hope you can hear the birds. It's so beautiful down in here. Hello guys, <laughs> we're at the end. We hit a fence, so that marks the end of the property, or the edge of the property. So we'll just head on back down and can continue back on the main road down into the draw. Okay guys, we're back on the main road, but oh, these yellow wildflowers are just blooming everywhere. It's so beautiful down here. It's so peaceful and green and oh. I made the comment to Randy, it smells so good. And he goes, oh, but it sounds even better. So we're just going to continue on down the road. Okay, guys, here's where we came. And just to give you some perspective, there's the barn that's parked by the bus. And the bus is right to the right of it. Um, you can kind of make it out from here. Um, but I don't know if you guys will be able to see it or not, but believe me, it's up there. Okay, guys, we came from down there, and um, there's a, the creek is running down below. And up above up there is where the bus is and the barn and the house and all of the outbuildings. And we're just kind of continuing on down the road, but I wanted to share this, how it kind of opened up. And, yeah, it's very cool in here. I can see why the family suggested taking this hike. Okay, guys, um, we've circled around the bottom of the property, came out on the main road, and now we're um, hiking up the lane up to the house. So we're going to just continue on up this road here right there there's our road leading up to the house and the bus okay guys we're back where this hike all began right here this is the road that we took down right here and we're back at the road leading up to the house and the barn and the bus She jumped right over the fence, you guys. She's looking right at us. Oh, I think that might be a buck. It's got little nubbins coming. It does. Wow, as soon as I turned the camera off, I thought, well, she won't jump that, or he won't jump that fence. He <laughs> just went right over that fence like it was nothing. That explains my, oh, there's more further out. They're right there. At the edge of the building on the corner. He's a young one, huh? 
Yeah, he must just be a yearling. Mm -hmm. Here's one right outside the bus window, guys. Hey there, Mr. Squirrel. Good morning. It's going to be a beautiful day. Well, it's kind of cloudy and overcast, but he's got plenty of fur to keep him warm. You stay in your house, I'll stay in mine. <laughs> There's two of them living in this little... They put sheet metal underneath over top of some lumber to keep it dry and this and these digger squirrels are using it for their home. Check it out, the bus is underneath another rainbow. It's beautiful. There was almost a double for a little bit. Yeah. No, it's too, it's too big. The thing about rainbows is they're here and they're gone. It's just like, wow. I know, they're so cool. Take some of these lilacs and put in your bow, in your bus for a bouquet too. Yeah, I'm surprised Shelly hasn't done that. She's welcome too.